Hey, what's up, everyone? This is Scott from Scott Mason Games, and I'm here to uh, finally do the Griselda the Hag quest. Uh, this is a classic quest that I just haven't done yet, and I'm trying to get uh, get done all the classic ones uh, before I move on to any uh, any more advanced ones because uh, quests are are easy, they're fun. Um, so yeah. Um, now this this one is probably going to take me more than one episode. Um, it might last me throughout the week, so probably 15 minutes in, I'm just gonna I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna stop whatever I'm doing, unless I have like one or two more things to kill. But I'm gonna stop what I'm doing, and then I'll, you know, say my say what I usually say in the episode, and then we'll just pick off from where where I left off in the other episode. So yeah, this will most likely be a multi parter I talk. The ancient wrink wrinkled hag looks up from her vile smelling cauldron. Her single unblinking eye attempts to focus in on you, but to little avail. Eh? Who is it? Who's there? Come, uh, come to trouble an old woman, have you? Oh, oh, oh. Hang on. I'll split you open and swallow your guts. I'll turn you into a pile of goo. I will, bah, as if I didn't have enough to worry about. As if I, sorry, as if I've not had enough trouble as it is. Another one of my blasted apprentices has gone missing. Foolish children. They think they know everything. It's like you're just going to scroll down. I should turn a lot of them into toads. If only they'd return with their task complete, but that's the trouble in it. They ha they they never return. But you don't care, do you? I suppose you're another one of those meddlesome kids coming to ask me for something. Hey, is that it? You want you want something from me? Expect me to hand it over? I've had enough troubles with my apprentices and that vile imp, Zeph. Zeev Zorpo. Why, I bet it's him who got that lot of... Uh, ah, who got the lot of them. I can't speak today. It's early in the morning. And who knows what he's done, vile little thing. If you expect me to help you with your silly little desires, you'll be doing something for me first, eh? I expect you to seek out my apprentice. I sent him along the road west of here towards Yu's graveyard, but he's never come back. Find him and bring him back, and I'll give you a little reward that I'm sure you'll find pleasant. But I tell ye to watch out for the imp named Zif uh, Zorpo. He's a despicable little beast who likes to fool around and fiddle with folks and if generally and generally making life miserable for everyone. If he get if he if he get your get him on your backside, you're sure to end up uh, ruin the day you were born. As if you didn't already <laughs> with an ugly mug like that. Oh, this, this lady's a, a nice one. She's a nice lady. Well, you little whelp, going to help an old hag or not? Eh, I guess. Somewhat out of character for the vile old witch, she accepts seemingly... Sorry, she, she actually seems delighted that you've accepted her offer. Dyslexia doesn't help as, as well. Reading backwards, not good. Ah, oh, that's the spirit. You're not a useless bag of bones after all, are you? Well then, best uh, best get your hind quarters in, in gear and head towards the road. Remember, my young apprentice could be anywhere along the road heading towards the U graveyard, so be sure to run the whole course of it. Stay in, stay on track. And for and for oh, one sec here. And for gosh knock's sake, come come here when you've found something. And remember, I don't have all day. And watch out for the Imzif Zorpo. And don't return empty handed. And pack a, pack a warm sweater. And don't trample on my, on my lawn on the way out. What? What are you still doing here? Get to it. Shoo! 
I always like to read out, despite the fact that I read it backwards sometimes. No, I didn't want to remove that. No, I clicked the wrong button. All right. Rune Library, you shall be my guide. Come on, double click. Click, click, click. So I'm supposed to follow this road and find a dead body. Follow the yellow brick road. Oh, hey! You see a strange imp stealing a scrap of paper from the blood, a bloody corpse. Oh, that's not good. You inspect the charred and bloody corpse, recognizing it from the hag's description. As the lost apprentice, you were were tasked to bring back. It appears as if he has been scorched by fire and magic and scratched at with some vicious claws. You wonder if uh, this hor horrific act is the work of the vile imp Zeef Zorpol, of which the hag spoke. You decide you'd best return to the hag and report your findings. <coughs> oh, that's it. So back to the hag. What's up, hey? How you doing? Oh wait, this isn't the hag. <laughs> I gotta take a room. Take a take a porter. There we go. What's up, hag? How you doing? Talk. The wrinkled old hag looks up from her cauldron. Boiling innards. Bah, back already. Can't you see I'm busy with my cooking? You wouldn't like to have a little taste of my delicious dragon gizzard soup, would you? Ha, huh, I thought as much. Enough of this jibber jabber, then. What news of my apprentice? What's that? You say that the horrible little imp Zeep Ze Zorpol was behind the disappearance? What would Zeep Ze Zorpol want with my apprentice? Probably just wants to make life more miserable for me than it already is. Wait, bah! That must be it. Zeef Zorpal must have found out that I sent my apprentice with various magic brew recipes. The lists of tasks and ingredients that needed completing. That despicable Zeef Zorpal knows that I need the list of ingredients I gave to the apprentice. I have recipes to mix, stews to boil, magics to cast, and fortunes to metal. Fortunes to metal. I won't let that wretched fletch scum spoil my day. You then. I need you to find Zeef Zorpal and get that scrap of parchment back. I'm not sure where he bides his time. Sorry, I'm not sure where he bides his time, but I'm sure if you go to find his imp friends and rough them up, they'll squeal on him in no time. They all know each other's secret hiding places. Go on, shoo. Go slay a few imps until they cough up the secrets. No mercy for those little nasties. Alright. Time to kill some imps. What's up, horse? How you doing? Okay, good. They didn't teleport me like right into the <laughs> right into the lair. Like, oh, suddenly I'm surrounded by like ten imps. Lovely. That's a mong bat. I don't care. I don't care about those guys. Guys can die. What's up, mong bat? You didn't even hit me. You hit me. It was weak. Yo, weak imp. Where the hell are the imps? Imps, imps, are there imps around here? Imps, 
Hello. Skeletons, ghouls, goats, sheep, llama. I don't see any imps. Are there any imps around? Figure they get te teleported somewhere within their radius. Okay. Uh, yeah, imps. Have any of you seen an imp around? I kind of need to kill one or two or five. Rune Library. I'm going to head back. So, imps to justice. Whatever that means. There are imp around here. Seriously, this is the least helpful moon gate ever. Imps to justice. Where were the hell are the imps? I would like to know that. Uh huh. It's a monk bat. I highly doubt a mong bat counts as an imp. Come on now, where are the imps? Horse, bear. Hmm. Seems this is not working. We'll find another place for imps, since that rune does not exactly tell you where to go, or does it? It doesn't lead you anywhere. No, I don't care about that. No, I don't care about that. Cemetery. No. All right. Oh, this is what, what, uh, it's like here, imps. That was a good place to find an imp. Spawn locations. A dungeon, no, burn forest. What is this burn forest? Nope, that doesn't help. Humility jungle. Yeah, that works. Doesn't say it had to be in a specific location. So I'm just going to assume that, you know, I can I can go kill imps anywhere, even in a different faucet. All right, let's kill some imps. Imps. Can I get an imp? Imp? No, I don't want a paragon skeleton. I thought there were supposed to be imps in this jungle. The hell? Ah, an imp. If I could only target him. Oh, that's a mong bat. Ooh, that's an imp. 
Target. Yeah, damn it! So, as I said, if I only if I could only target him. Hey, Mr. Imp. Oh, two imps. I got all the imps I want now, haven't I? Stay still for a freaking second. No, really, like stay still for a moment. Stay still. There we go. Okay, now I can kill you. See, I just need your your thingy up. Okay, that's one imp. Okay. Okay. Um. What the hell's up with that? Okay. He's healing himself. Come on. Oh, come on. Really? You kidding me? Oh, come on, are you kidding me? <laughs> really? Stop this nonsense. There we go, that's one. I get these stinking mung bats out of my hair. <laughs> okay. Guess I should kill that imp first. That's one. That's two. That's three. There we go. Ah, there we go. Perfect. Okay, anyway. The wretched imp cries out for mercy. Forgive me, my master! You, you great warrior, great human, great greatest. Forgive, forgive, I give up Zeef. He no good anyway. He always smack my enemy head and hurt me good. He say I ugly too, even with me pretty teeth. Okay. But I knows where he hide. I follow him flapping to his hidey hole. He think he's so smart, but he so wrong. I make scribble drawing of where he like to hide. But you need to whistle. The, you need the whistle blower to make him come. He no come without it. Make it with uh, uh, make with the whistle at his hidey place, and Zeef must come. He cannot resist. The frightened imp hands you a crumpled map and a strange flute. You go to where he where the picture shows, and then you play the, that whistle. Zeef come. He promise. But you make promise that you uh, that you smack Zeef head good, <laughs> please. With that, with the last request, the miserable little imp fails to breathe no more. Okay, well, that's always good. Zelda the Hag. Uh-huh. Oh, okay, I see, I see, I see. I guess I didn't have to go back to the hag. Well, I'm going to do that part uh, next time because uh, I'm, uh, I'm out of time here. Uh, this has been Scott from Scott Mason Games playing Ultima Online. If you enjoyed the video, please click on the like button and don't forget to subscribe. I'm going to put this uh, flute in the bank here so I don't lose it.
Well, anyway, guys, I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.